doing? I'm finishing up my day. It's almost five o'clock. And I'm just looking at some emails, trying to see any last minute folks wanna send in some stuff and whatnot. Y'all see me over here glistening? I put on some, um, some body splash so I can go to Trader Joe's, right? I ain't, hair look a mess. I ain't went no do rag last night. So had it is, I'ma find me some lip gloss and that's how we rolling this evening. But how are you guys doing? How was your day? How was your work day? What's going on? How is it? <sighs> it's busy over here today. I had to turn down my, um, I'm sorry, I had to look at something. I had to turn down my, um, you know how you have your emails that come like ding, ding, ding. I had to turn, it was so many coming in because tomorrow I have a, um, a training. So I'll be going into the office tomorrow. So I have to, when I take my shower tonight, I got to make sure I brush my hair down and put my do-rag on so I can look presentable tomorrow. So tomorrow I don't have to get snazzy or anything like that. Just look, you know, presentable. I'm only training two people, which is good. It's going to be, it was from 10 to 2, but it's only going to be from 10.30 to 2. Might, be, might even be maybe 10.30 to 1 because it's straightforward. It's very straightforward. So, yeah, I'm excited. I'm excited. Let me change arms here because, you know, I get tired after a while. So I'm going to go to Trader Joe's. I need to get me some new flowers. My birthday flowers are dead. And I need some things to eat because I'm not sure if I mentioned to you guys that I'm on a soft diet. Because I really don't chew anything that's too firm or, like, crunchy, like chicken or anything like that. Fried chicken or anything crunchy because my tooth is cracked. So, um, now I'm thinking about my tooth. I just sat there and put my tongue on it. So, I'm going to get me, like, some soft stuff, maybe, like, pasta, some salmon. I can eat salad, but sometimes crunching on, depending on, like, the lettuce. I felt funny the other day I was eating a salad, and I was like, ooh. So, I can do grits. I could do oatmeal, stuff like that. So, I'm going to just get me a couple of things that can kind of just last me over until the 22nd that's when i have my um that's when i go back <laughs> they're gonna give me a volume so we're gonna see how that works out but let's get in this car i got two minutes to five and i'm gonna log off and trader joe's here we go I was pleasantly surprised. I'm sitting here hot. I bought my fanny pack out with me. Meanwhile, I should have bought my purse because I can't carry it on my junk. But it's cool. I'm leaving this here. Where are my keys at? Huh? See, I ain't got no room. Let's go in here and get some stuff. I want you guys to let me know what are some. I want some, you guys to let me know what are some of your favorite items from Trader Joe's. Like I've never tried this buffalo dip that everybody's talking about. This chicken dip is is new to me. Old probably everybody. So I want to get some of that. A bunch of like this snacky foods. I gotta be careful because you know a lot of things in Trader Joe's have a little salt. So you gotta be careful with that because that can definitely swell you up and yeah we can't have that but yeah let's go in here and get us some snacky snacks <laughs>
up. Y'all. Okay, y'all. So I'm done shopping at Trader Joe's. They had so much stuff and it's crazy. I thought that that chicken dip was in another area, but it was in another area that I wouldn't even thought to even look in, but the gentleman, he got it for me. So now I get to try it. I did pick up me this cold pressed juice. It's watermelon. Yo, I've been feeling watermelon lately. So I got that. And I got me the Buffalo style chicken wrap. I'm gonna try to eat this while I'm driving. I got some napkins. I'm about to be real greedy. And I'm about to eat. I haven't eaten all day. I got me some cold brew, y'all. I'm gonna try it. I heard some really good things, so we're gonna try it out. I meant to get some creamer. I spent more than what I came in here for. I had a budget of $60. I spent $110. It's time to go home. So whatever I didn't get, it ain't gonna get that. But I definitely want to get a creamer and I wanted to get um some other little knickknacks. But I got some good stuff just to you know have during the week. And then plus since I'm going into work, my job does have a microwave, so I could take some things with me when I go, stuff like that. You know, you kind of gotta save, right? You gotta save. So phone ringing. No. Okay, so let's get back to the house so we can do this haul. I can show you what I got, but I'm getting ready to tear up this wrap so y'all won't see this. So, preview of the haul right here. <laughs> and it's watermelon cold press. See y'all when we get to the house. All right, y'all. Okay, so we finally made it home. Let's go through this stuff before this stuff melts. I got something to go in the freezer like ASAP. I got three bags. This is my blue cheese sauce from that wrap. Let me tell you something. That wrap did not make it. It did not make it. <clears throat> Excuse me. I tore that wrap up. It was so good. But I'm gonna hit the blue cheese because I got the, the dipping thing. I'm gonna show you guys. But I picked up these here. These are gluten-free cinnamon coffee cake muffins. Moist sour cream cake with cinnamon bites and brown sugar y'all know i don't need this but i got it um i picked up two cold brews i picked up a vanilla and i picked up a black so i got those two and put them in the fridge I also picked up some grilled chicken. This is heat and serve. Cause I was like, I can at least eat like some spinach and then I could put the chicken on top. But this is soft chicken. And then I picked up this. I don't know how to pronounce this, but it's spaghetti and rich creamy sauce with all of that, some cheese and some black pepper. So if you guys had this before, I hear this is really, really good. The sodium on this, I don't even want to tell y'all. But I'm gonna line this up nice and neat so I can slide it in the I can slide it in the um the freezer. I got three bags, y'all. Three bags. So I got these little dumplings, y'all. These are so good. When I tell you, my daughter put me on to these. These dumplings is pork and ginger soup dumplings. If you're not into eating pork and all that good stuff, you ain't gonna want none of this. But you put this in the microwave real quick for about three minutes. Good. And I got them in chicken as well. I got some of that vegetable fried rice. You cook it one, two, three. And it's 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 done. It tastes good too. I usually get the um a bug bit me. Ugh. I usually get the um the little orange chicken, I think it is, but I didn't get it this time. Next up, I got this one. It's a saucy, if you can see it. It is saucy scallops with mushrooms. So I had to put something in the freezer before it melts. It is so hot outside. When I tell you so hot, it's so hot. 
Then I got some more dumplings, but these got shrimp in them. What's this? This is seafood pie paella. It has rice, shrimp, calamari, mussels, and bell pepper. Something nice and quick to eat, you know, while you home for right now. And even once I go into the office, I could take a bowl and I could put it in the um the microwave. But yeah, not not this per se. This is stove top. But I'm getting ready to show you, yes. So this right here, this is what I'm gonna take to work with me. I'm gonna take this tomorrow to be exact. This is cod. So this is cod with like some wild rice and some um, zucchini. And I also got this one. This one is salmon. And this one is wild salmon and yogurt with mint sauce orzo pasta with spinach and zucchini. Isn't that pretty? Look at this one. I know it don't look like that, but we'll take it. I got y'all on the cereal box again. That's why I'm scooting down. And these things right here, so good. They hot, but they so good. I ate, one time I made these. My daughter had one. Both my daughters had one. How many come in here? It's 10 pieces. I ate all of them by myself. That's how good they are. And then I got some of these um, little pastry bags, like a little pig in a blanket, little sausage or hot dog type thing. I like stuff like this. This is this is the problem, stuff like this. I love it. Next up, I got me some flowers. My birthday flowers are dying. So I got me some flowers. Now they're pink, some pink. Oh God, wait, wait a minute. There we go. <laughs> so I got some flowers. I got this here. I might eat this tonight. This is linguine with clam sauce. So, and I can put some chicken in this. It's, um, it might be some pieces of clam in here. I'm not too sure. Come on. Okay, here we go. So this one here, this is the linguine and clam sauce. It might be some pieces of clam in here, but if not, I can um, put some chicken on this and then just be like the clam sauce taste. I got some watermelon, because I like a watermelon. And to be honest, I hate cutting watermelon. I really do, because I have nowhere to store it. Like, I mean, of course I have a refrigerator, but when you buy a big watermelon like that, you gotta have like, you cut it in pieces, you gotta have somewhere to store that. So I ain't got time. I can eat this in one sitting. So this is two sittings right here. And I got me the buffalo chicken dip. I am excited about this, y'all. I got some crackers. I got some townhouse crackers. I got this here. This is the wine country chicken salad with white chicken meat cranberries and pecans yes there's nuts in here but i've had this a thousand times before and it's not crunchy crunchy hard so you won't i won't mess up anything and i also got me some soup broccoli and chowder soup this is going to be super good i can't wait can't wait and can't wait broccoli i thought this was um clam chowder it's broccoli and cheddar soup Anyway, I still eat it, so it's good. So that is my haul, y'all. I hope you guys enjoy it. Something sim simple. I wanted to um, get a few things just to have so I can nibble on soft in a conjunction to what I went grocery shopping for on Saturday. So when you go to Trader Joe's, I don't do a full shop in Trader Joe's. This little bit of food was $100. I went to Walmart and I bought a whole bunch of food for like almost three hundred dollars it was like 271 so i'm good my baby won't eat any of this this is all mine so i have to figure this out <laughs> and i have to drink a lot of water when you eat in food like this packaged food it has a lot of salt so you gotta drink a lot of water so 
I hope you enjoy. Let me know if you tried any of these um, items. And if you have, let me know which ones. And if it's something that I did not pick up, something that you got from Trader Joe's, let me know because I want to go and try it out. You know, it's nothing like trying out new food. I'm a greedy girl. So, let me know. <laughs> See you guys. I want to say hey to all my new subscribers. Hey to all my loyals. Thanks for hanging out, man. Catch my next video. Bye. <laughs>